worked at Microsoft for almost three years, saved up enough money, and then I decided to take the plunge and go indie. I remember I had a coworker who was like, why would you do this? When you make an indie game, it's always like a big roulette or of are you going to actually succeed or not, I guess. I told Dan like, hey, I've been playing Smash competitively for like four years. I've been programming in Game Maker for eight years. How about you hire me? The more I played it, the more I felt like it was a game that actually cared about competitive nature. Back then, we kind of thought this was it. This is our one chance to go in person and compete on a large stage. It was no longer like, I'm not in college and I'm not just like building this game for fun in the labs. Like, like I'm going to run out of money eventually, right? For us, we were like, this is the start of something even bigger. Back then, if you really committed yourself, anyone could be the best player. The rival's character design is actually insane. What I can definitely say is that the Rebels of the community is incredibly dedicated to their game. You feel that you're a part of just this giant family. <laughs>